Hi, it's Alaska Granny. I've been reading about the economic hardships in Latin American countries and the goods that people are saying they're severely limited, the quality is poor, or the value, the cost of them has become prohibitive. So I'm thinking, wow, we are a global society and bad things that are coming to other countries should be a wake-up call of what could possibly be ahead for us. So I looked at the things that people were saying they were unable to get, they were of poor quality or they were just too expensive and decided those were things that were important to me that I wanted to make sure that I had enough of those things. So I thought, wow, if they're important to me, they possibly could be to you too. So I'm going to share with you the items that people in uh, hardship situations in Latin America are saying that they wish they had sugar. Sugar seems to be an ample supply to us, so I, it's a good thing that I'm going to make sure that I have plenty. Oil is another thing that they're complaining is either unavailable or is extremely poor quality. I don't want to take a chance that I don't have a basic food, so that's something that I want to make sure I have enough. Flour has also been, the price has been rising dramatically. That's a basic food that we love to eat bread, pasta, tortillas, things like that. Make sure that you have enough of those basic food items. Milk is something that is also scarce in other places and so milk is a thing that we need uh, nutritionally for many of our people and family members and it is also nice for lots of the foods that we prepare. So figure out how to find milk for an emergency situation because what you're going to have in your refrigerator isn't going to last very long. Some of the powdered milks are just horrid so maybe we need to be on the lookout and find one that we enjoy or make sure you have some st shelf stable packages of milk but be sure you rotate them because they just don't last forever. Tea is something that people have been out, unable to find and it's something that I enjoy on a daily basis so I want to make sure that I have enough of that and then toilet paper. In some of the countries that the government has taken over the businesses and because they've made an economic climate that is simply uh, not supportive to private industry and so then the government has taken over and they might have some toilet paper but it's of extremely poor quality. That to me is a basic need. I know that I can't eat it, it won't keep me alive but it can certainly enhance my life and make sure that I am comfortable by having plenty of that. And I think my whole family feels the same way. So that's one of the things. So those six items are the things that I took from what I read and decided to make sure to have enough sugar, oil, flour, milk, toilet paper, and tea. So think about the things that are most important to you that would actually be the basics you would need for your care and comfort and your necessities and make sure that you have enough of them and that you keep them in ready supply. You know how to use the things that you store and that you rotate them. Please subscribe to Alaska Granny and have a wonderful day.